Hey there guys, and in this video I'm going to show you how to get the 666 Havel kills and the 1 million souls to get Beast Mode and Soul Reaper trophies or achievements within the Darksiders 3 game. Guys, welcome to Gation Network and we are here at Haven in the West End where I will show you the farm location and the route for getting the Havel kills and the 1 million souls. So let's just start right away with showing you the route and it is area there's going to be these ghouls here and there are like 21 in total so you want to go here and aggro the three enemies right there and then you want to go to the far left and also aggro these ghouls here in the middle so if you are on the left side jump on the platform with the flame hollow to get these three guys agreeing you and then you want to go to the parking garage and then go directly to the next floor and aggro the five ghouls there and then drop down for the last three ghouls and then simply go to the middle and wait until they're like grouped around you you have a chance that some ghouls run away but it doesn't really matter that much but Go in the corner and then wait until they're like all really close to each other and then you activate your havoc form and then kill them as fast as possible. I recommend only using the first melee attack because the combo will let you miss some of the guys and then you're stuck in the animation so the havoc bar keeps draining. You will possibly one shot these guys so you can just use your first melee attack every time and then quickly press the two buttons from activating the havoc form because then you will deactivate it. What you want to do now is kill yourself, what is easy to do because with the patch 1.04 you can now kill yourself from the option menu. So now your Havoc bar is a little drained, so if you have the enhancements to generate your Havoc back with your weapon, it is really easy to get the Havoc bar full again. You can also use the enhancements to generate the Havoc bar per minute and the one that will let the Havoc form have a longer duration so the bar doesn't get drained that much. You can also just use a Havoc Shard, but these are like limited and you can buy them, but they will increase in soul value every time you buy one. But I don't recommend buying them because you will need the souls to get the other trophy or achievement. But I'm going to get back on that later. So now what do you want to use with the enhancements? Just let the ghouls follow you again and let them group and just simply kill them with the whip. So you get your Havoc form back and then kill yourself from the option menu and let the ghouls group again. Use your Havoc form to kill them again and then repeat until you get the trophy or achievement. So now guys I'm going to talk about the 1 million souls you need to collect. So this means you don't need to have a total of 1 million in your possession. But the thing is here, every time you destroy the soul demon and get your lost souls back from the last time you killed yourself, these will stack up with the total collected souls, even though they were already in your possession before. So every time you farm the ghouls, you want to get your souls back before killing yourself. You can also speed it up if you have a large amount of soul crystals saved up and scatter them and then simply kill yourself at the checkpoint and keep destroying the soul demon to get your souls back and repeat this. But if you don't have soul crystals like me, because I started doing this farming after the game when I had no crystals left, I just kept farming until I had beast mode unlocked and then farm up to like 25,000 souls. And then I just kept killing myself by the checkpoint and I just got it after killing myself two times. So you can see that it works. I hope they won't patch this, but I think they won't because it would be dumb. And I don't really see this as a glitch, but if they do, well, you're basically fucked because the grind is really stupid. But guys, that is how I got Beast Mode and Soul Reaper. If you have any questions, you can ask them in the comment section down below. And if you have a better or faster way on getting these trophies or achievements, then do comment as well. You can help out people who are also grinding this like crazy. But guys, that wraps up the video and I thank you for watching. And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button. And if you want more gaming videos like this one, then you can subscribe to the channel and hit the bell so you don't miss anything. But guys, I wish you success with grinding and I wish you an awesome day.